All right, so two truly elite strikers here. We sat down with them on Thursday and asked them, any thoughts of taking this fight to the ground? They want to strike. They want to strike. That's what got them to the show. That is the path that they are normally on. And tonight, they get someone that allows them to fight in their comfort zone. They don't have to worry about defending takedowns. All they have to worry about is who can rely on their knowledge in the striking to carry them to victory. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Head kick. And Ganu gets touched by that kick there. Oh, really exploiting his reach. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, big left. Over three minutes now to go. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. Pretty good right hand. Oh, do you believe that another head kick lands? Got to start raising that guard, or this is going to be. Right up the gut, DC. He's in a world of trouble now. They say the straight moves are the ones that get there first, and it got right to the target. Blocks that strike. Oh, just a killer jab there from Francis Ngannou. I don't know about you fighting this guy, man. Aren't you coaching high school wrestling yeah, instead I'm coaching or something? Yeah, I'm coaching Mustang. When <laughs> they say Ngannou, I say, I got a tournament this weekend. I'll see you guys on the flip side. And Ngannou gets hit with a kick. Lance with a right hand. Nice head kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh, he lands a knee to the body now, DC. Talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going forward. You walk full speed to a knee to the body. They put it in the night. Oh, a big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. Wow! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Final seconds of round one. Oh, big left hook there. What an end to round one. All right, there's the horn signifying the end of the... All right, here we go with our second round now. Conor McGregor and the Predator, Francis Ngannou. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Nice punch by Francis Ngannou. As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range. He'll suddenly he'll change his stance. Oh, thought he might have had that head kick, but just out of range. So the numbers continue to pile up. 30 total strikes have landed for Francis Ngannou. Well, misses on 60% of the strikes, landing with just 40% accuracy against Conor McGregor. Well, we told you off the top he had the reach advantage, and you saw it right there with that punch. Look is there again. Forward, forward, forward. Oh, McGregor's kick attempt. That one was blocked. Just over three minutes to go in round two. So a much different approach from him here in round two. It took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Good stick. Ooh, head kick lands was hurt. Well, it's not due to a lack of effort. He continues to throw, but this is like double-A striking. This is not high level. Yeah, you can't be missing. It takes so much energy to just... Oh! He's out! He got him! What a fight! Just an absolutely gorgeous shot 